guys uh her lady just proved that whiskey is not such a big deal to book at all like the almighty whiskey who is so popular in nigeria and africa so it's not such a big deal to book like if you want to book whiskey you can book him anytime so there's this video that is circulating online about uh, that showed whiskey performing in a private party and that private party they just have all his guests present at that private party and one of the guests was celebrating her birthday and this guy flew Whiskey all the way from Nigeria to Cameroon and Whiskey performed at that private party of seven guests and went back to Nigeria. She's single, she's not married. She's not a billionaire's daughter, she's not a billionaire's wife. I don't know her, but I know that she's not married to any of the billionaire or she's a billionaire daughter. I know that quite all right. So what is this girl actually doing? To have that mind, to have that resources, to book whiskey all the way from Nigeria, flew him and his crew all the way from Nigeria to Cameroon. Whiskey perform at a private party of just seven ladies. No men involved. Seven ladies. And after performing, he flew her, flew him back, paying him full payment. You see, guys, some people have money. And uh, as long as you have money, you can get any celebrity to perform at the show. Any celebrity at all. If you have money... It's not a big deal at all to book any celebrity. Like, I was so surprised seeing Whiskey performing, dancing. Like, you can see the video I'm showing. Dancing, performing at a private party of just seven ladies. I was so surprised. Well, I, I thought that Whiskey was just invited for the birthday. But no, Whiskey wasn't invited. Whiskey was paid full payment to perform at that party. And it's really, really, like, he... he, he it really blew my mind, honestly. Like some people do have money, eh? Because I'm pretty, pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that to book somebody like Whiskey nowadays, flying him around, you should be able to cough out at least, at least close to two hundred thousand dollars or one hundred fifty thousand dollars to hundred hundred thousand dollars to two hundred thousand dollars. And this guy just cough it out. He just cough it out, and Whiskey came there like wrong, like mad. Run like an errand boy going there to perform. Even was smiling. He was he was even nervous around those ladies, as you can see in the videos. He was nervous, like he couldn't even keep his cool around those ladies, like whiskey, seeing money. So guys, really, really baffled. But I don't want to dress so much. Uh, at at the end of the day, it's all about making money for whiskey. He doesn't care if uh if he's performing at the child birthday party. It's all about making money. He's an entertainer, so that's his job. You booked him and he come there to do his job and uh, he just lived there. So guys, uh, there's this story that I want to address about this rumor that Tiwa Service might be expecting a child for whiskey. He has been going on for a while and I decided just to speak about it now because it is trending. People are talking about it. So, you know, when people, when news like that are trending, I like to also share my view. To share what I actually feel about that particular news, so I feel like I should also give my bit of that news to everybody and to viewers out there. First of all, I don't believe if Tiwa Savage is pregnant, but if she is, then I think it has been a plan for a very long time. Because honestly, Tiwa Savage has already made it known that. Uh, you know, despite those years, it has been so many years that whiskey and Tiwa Savage has been an item, but they have not publicly came come out to like address this uh, their relationship or admit that they are in a relationship. But this year, last year, last year in December when they were performing, Tiwa Savage made it known to the entire fans, to our entire fans that see. He is dating Whiskey, he is in love with Whiskey. When he mentioned that at a particular show, she mentioned that uh, when she made a phrase of uh, the older the berry, the sweeter the juice. 
So, and uh, all the love and affection they were showing on stage there, you could actually see that, yeah, those guys are really dating. But people still don't find it easy to believe because people want them to come out to say, yes, we are dating well. They, they already did that last year when they were performing on stage. But when people start stepping it up and say that, so, so these guys might be expecting the child together, that is some crazy things i don't know because i didn't see any uh pregnancy bomb until was savage when she was performing i never made such as an announcement but if it's true it's a good thing it's just like fairy tale of uh fairy tale of uh people like uh, just like fairy tale of uh, rihanna and drake or rihanna chris brown it's like whiskey until was savage because we all know that they are the biggest female and uh, male artists over than Joa right now. It's not, it's not something you can compete at all in any way. They are the biggest. So when they come together and like have a kid, it's like some, it's, it's kind of like good because that will be with kid fourth child, but to have a second child. So they all have, they both have their kids, their children outside their relationship. So it's a really cool thing. I'm not hating at all. I don't want to say the news is fake or anything. But honestly, I don't believe it's true anyway. I think they're just like enjoying each other because I guess, I guess if even if they are planning to have service, they probably need to have whiskey kid more than whiskey kid need to have a to have service child because to have service only has a one uh, one child why whiskey have a handful like theory so whiskey i don't think whiskey will be wanting any kids now but she was having the other and that's the reason why she might be looking to get pregnant well like i've said there's no big deal at all i'm wishing her all the best but why why would they want to have kids they already have kids. Well, why well, well, the one to have kids? Like I've said, I don't really believe if this story is true or what they are saying. But if it's true, then to us, I will be very, very public with their relationship, despite not openly confirming that they are in a relationship. But they are very, very active and public. When I mean active, when you see them on stage, you see them doing those kind of lovely stuff. Or when you see them always going on functions with each other, you see them on shows, you see them on uh, comedy shows, you know, see them going out and doing business with each other uh, for a long while. And uh, there's nothing bad in that if Tiwa Sabi is actually pregnant and people have reported at all, there's nothing bad in that. And uh, that is to show you that uh, Whiskey might be expecting his baby number four and Tiwa Sabi might, might be expecting a baby number two. Don't forget, Tiwasabi was uh, initially married to Tbilis, and uh, Whiskey is not married yet, but uh, had a bunch of kids with other women. And Whiskey even said that he is looking forward on getting married this year, 2020. Well, I don't know how true that is, but Whiskey made the announcement via his Twitter a few days ago before his show that, see, he's finding it hard Right, that right now is is find is is finding it hard on how to tell his other wife that he's gonna settle down with just one woman, and definitely that's Diva Savage. So well, like I've said, I don't know how serious those to her, but uh, definitely there's report that uh, Tiwa Savage is pregnant. And I have been the way I've been looking at it, I think Tiwa Savage had this coming for a long while. He has this coming like uh, he really, really wanted to get pregnant. For me, that is how I see it. I think she really, really wanted to get pregnant for was for whiskey for a very long time, and uh, that is what she has been driving at. Well, it's a good thing, like I've said. I'm not like her. Uh, I'm not like her uh, discriminating her for doing it, but well, <laughs> the boat match the. So guys, I don't want to dwell so much about this video. I'll, uh, I think I'm going to end this video here. Yeah, you already know it's your boy, Adam Slink Media. If you're new to my channel, please make sure you click on the subscribe button below. 
Make sure to click on the bell notification so you can get updates on all our new content. And don't forget to like this video, comment on it, and share it on our social media platform. Follow us on Instagram and on Twitter. Instagram is Adam Slink Media, and on Twitter is Zed Bad Daily. See you guys on my next video. Bye.